Six shots were fired at James Boyd, three hit him, but the debate over who fired the fatal shot continues. So the one to the back could have caused his death, but not necessarily either. Yes. So you don't know which bullet caused his death then, correct? It was a combination of the gunshot wounds. Okay, which one caused the most bleeding, do you know? Internally. Well, it would be gunshot wound A. What's that? Gunshot wound A. A, I'm sorry. To the lower left back. This one, I think it's... Uh... We are learning whose shots landed where. Sandy hit him twice, both in the arms. Perez didn't fire his first shot until Sandy fired his third and final one, which missed Boyd. Only one of Perez's bullets hit Boyd, and it was the one to his lower back. So he's now really rotated 90 degrees from his initial stance. Um, he's also leaning forward, and this is the first shot of Officer Perez that uh, most likely strikes uh, the lower middle of Mr. Boyd's back. Of course, passes through his body and ends up in his left shoulder. Uh, and then Mr. Boyd will continue falling towards the ground. I'm going to show you the video again, but slowed down. The prosecution claims the video proved Boyd had his hand at his sides and is slowly turning away. The forensic expert also says the canine officer and his handler had also already turned away even before Sandy fired his first shot.